What's going on, y'all? Machiavelli Mills TV. So look, y'all, singer, songwriter. Uh, I don't know if he's a producer or not, but y'all know Akon. Akon is facing criticism for these comments he made after the passing of renowned actor Michael K. Williams. Now, y'all know Michael K. Williams. He was Omar on The Wire, a show that I love, one of my favorite shows of all time. And he was recently on a show that I really enjoyed that was recently canceled, uh, Lovecraft Country, right? Um, after he passed away, there were, like, allegations of him passing away from a drug overdose, right? They found him with drugs. It was, like, drugs there when he was found dead in his, uh, his living room, living room of his apartment or whatever. And so a reporter comes up to Akon and say, did you hear about the death? And it's so crazy how even though he had money, he had fame, he still, you know, had those type of issues. And Akon then says, the famous and rich go through more problems than the poor. Right now, when he said this, I'm sitting down, I'm listening to him say this. I'm looking like, now, why the hell would he even say that? Like, huh? That don't make no sense. Right. First, let me say this first. First of all, it shouldn't be a competition about who goes through more hardship. Each and every social class has their own struggles to endure. And I'm well aware, I'm well aware of that. I also understand and, am empath and I'm empathetic to the fact that the rich and poor people can have similar struggles. Right. A rich and a poor person can both, both struggle from drug addiction, alcohol addiction. They can both suffer from depression, so on and so forth, right? And schizophrenia, all type of mental health issues, I understand that as well. However, rich people do not have more problems than the poor people, than the poor people, right? Now, more money, more problems is always a cool adage to say, but it's simply just not true, right? Because I can guarantee you, that a poor person would trade places with a rich person in a heartbeat, and it wouldn't, and uh, it wouldn't be the other way around. A rich person would never trade places with a poor person at all. I don't care how much problems they got, and oh man, this person wants some money, that person want money from me, this person want money from me. There is nothing that would equate to a person struggling to know where they're gonna sleep at night, to a person struggling to know where their next meal is gonna come. It will never equate to a person not wondering, can he feed? Can he or him or her feed their children at the end of the day and in the morning. Those things will never equate. So that statement was both inaccurate and insensitive by Mr. Akon, right? Um, a poor person would wish to have the money that Akon has in a lifetime. They would beg and plead to have that type of bread. So I'm looking like Akon, and Akon been poor before. So he should know how insensitive his statements were, like for real. Like rich people don't go through more issues than the poor at all. The problem is that money doesn't make your old issues or bad habits go away, right? If you're a reckless person when you are broke, you're going to be even more reckless when you got money to fund your reckless lifestyle. That's how it is, right? If you're if you're addicted to drugs, you're going to fall deeper into addiction when you have money to get drugs at your own leisure. That's just how it goes, right? But being poor is literally the worst thing that you can be. Like, imagine not knowing where your next meal is going to come from. Seriously, imagine being sleeping in the streets in the harsh winters of my hometown, Chicago, Illinois. There are people downtown that sleep downtown under the bridges to block the cold air from coming into where they sleep. So, all of, for all the problems that a rich person may endure, I would gladly have rich issues than to be wondering about where I'm going to get some clothes. Can I buy me a coat for the winter? Am I going to have a place to stay at night? Am I, am I going to be able to keep my lights on in the house? How I'm going to pay my rent? How I'm going to pay this bill, that bill? Like, I was like, bro, like, nah, man. Like, for real. If Akon, and the, if they go, if the rich and famous go through more problems than the poor, ask Akon to switch places with a poor person. And I bet you he won't do that. I bet you he ain't going to do that. He wouldn't do it. He wouldn't even think about it. For real, man. Like, and Akon, if you want less problems, furthermore, you can give your money to me. Give me all the bread you got. Throw your money all in my bank account. Dump it on me. Dump it on my bank account, and I will be. I will wipe my tears away with a hundred dollar bills that you got. All right. I will wipe all my tears away with a hundred dollar bills. Seriously, I will be glad to take them problems off of your hands if you can get the money to be to me. Give it to your boy for real, man. Like again, tell somebody who's been sleeping outside for the past month that you know um, a rich as a rich person. Tell a poor person who's been sleeping outside for the last month that, that you got more problems than them. They're going to look at you like you crazy. Tell somebody who haven't eaten, who hasn't eaten in a couple of days, man. Like, like for real, but they're going to look at you like you out your damn mind. So, and, and the thing is, Akon, ain't, he's, he didn't put his foot in his mouth before with several things, 
when he talked about how I think he's from Senegal, I believe, and he talks about how black people hold on to slavery too much, and that's why we have the problems we have now, or some shit like I'm paraphrasing, but it was something like how we need to just let slavery go. And I'm looking like, yeah, it's easy for your ass to say, no disrespect, but it's easy for you to say because you don't have um, ancestors who are here on American soil who are enslaved. So, of course, you can say we can forget. We don't even think about it in Senegal. We don't think about it because it wasn't affecting your people directly. You weren't descendants of that. So, of course, you're going to say that. That was extremely insensitive and ignorant for him to say then, which I was pissed off about when I heard him say that, right? So, he's been known to put his foot in his mouth. But I'm looking like people out here facing eviction in the pandemic, bro. Like, some people have outstanding hospital bills from COVID that they cannot pay for. They got hospital bills from all type of other issues they can't pay for. Their kids just started school. They need new school clothes. And Akon out here talking about the rich experience more problems than the poor. Really, bro? For real? Like, man, like, that type of statement will piss. That's going to piss the working the working class and the poor class and the poor people off. You know what I'm saying? Because a rich person can say all that, but we got more problems than the poor, all of that, while they sitting comfortably, comfortably in a mansion with a butler, with a chef, with a uh, with a, with a um, with a, a nanny, a private jet, and all of that, right? I'm looking like, bro, that nah, bro, that ain't that ain't some. That's not what you want to say right there. That's not it. You know what I'm saying that's that is not it. Again, I understand that poor and rich people can have similar issues, but the rich do not go through more than the poor at all. They don't have more problems than the poor. I believe Akon should have just said his condolences to Michael K. Williams and his family. Should have said rest in peace. Could have uh, commemorated his life or talked about, you know, um, just should have said rest in peace or so on and so forth and all of that, but left it at that, right? But the whole statement about the rich go through more problems than the poor, nah, bro, that's not accurate. That's not accurate and it's extremely insensitive um, to people who are really poor out here, who really struggling, who really don't know what they're going to do or who they can turn to. And that ain't, nah, man, I'm looking like that's, that ain't, that's not what nobody want to hear, right? That shit, nah, nah, Akon, ain't nobody feeling that at all, you know? So I feel like he could have chose his words better and um, he could have, sometimes everything that you think in your head does not sound good when it's coming out of your mouth. So maybe you should have thought a little bit longer before he made or said that, you know what I'm saying? Because again, the rich do not go through more than the poor. If you ask a, 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 poor, a rich person to switch places with a poor person, they're going to tell you, no, nah, they good. Because I've seen what real poverty looks like. I've seen it. Like, you know what I'm saying? I've seen it, and, and it, it's, it's, not a good, it's not a good feeling, right? Now, my people, we weren't poor, like, living on the street or none of that. But we had issues where some bills, come, my mom, we was coming up struggling to pay bills. I remember me and my mom and, and, and my sisters, we all in a one room with a, a electric heater on because the heat is off in our house in the wintertime. It's so cold. When you step out into the hallway, we could see our breath when we was talking. It was so cold in the hallways of the house that we was in, right? But it was warm as, warm as ever, warm as ever in this room. We had this heater on. We had a, a, um, a hot plate to warm up our water, to boil our water in, to wash up, and we was washing up good. You can never even tell that we didn't have no hot water in the house because we were smelling good. We was clean, washing our clothes, washing dishes, kept, washing dishes, kept the house clean and all of that. But it was cold as hell in there. You know what I'm saying? Without question, it was cold. And we were, we, we were, we survived for sure, for sure. But I'm saying, we wish we was uh, rich. Give us all them rich problems that you got. Give us all that money right now. We can change all this that we got in the, in the house. We can make the house warm again. We could all be sleeping in our own individual rooms. We could um, wash up and shower normally. We wish we would have had some rich problems then. Bring it all to us, my mama, all of us. We wish we could have had that at that point. So it sounded cool. It sound good, that old adage, more money, more problems. It sound cool to say, but it ain't really true, man. And uh, Akon could have used his words. He could have used his words more wisely, man. Machiavelli Mills TV. Thank y'all for watching. Like the video. Comment. Leave comments in the comment section. Subscribe to the channel. I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. Share the video to all your friends, your mama, sister, cousin, brother, niece, nephew, and all that to come subscribe to this channel. Come rock with me. Peace.